ladies and gentlemen, the guest speaker today at the National Press Club, the Prime Minister of Australia, the Right Honourable Julia Gillard. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. A great pleasure it is to speak to all you journalists here at the National Press Club. With friends like you, who needs enemies? Yes, you've all been so supportive of me over the last 18 months, but I don't go down without a fight. At least that's what my partner Tim keeps telling me. <laughs> Poor love, I don't think he enjoys being patron of the Pelvic Inflammatory Diseases Institute quite as much as Jeanette did. <laughs> Something wrong with the electrics, and I always thought the National Press Club was wind powered. <laughs> <laughs> Kevin, is that you? Yes, Anthony Waller was unavailable. I thought you were in Washington. I have come to claim what is rightfully mine. If you're after the video, I've already put it on YouTube. Silence! You cruelly cut me down when things looked bleak. But have you seen the polls just out this week? My people yearn for me, so let me say The man who speaks in Mandarin is back to save the day Work. It's pole driven. Just when I thought my life could get no worse, the name of Phantom strikes. I fear his curse. I thought I dealt with him, but now I find. Mind. Sing for me. Uh, Sing for me, my angel. Uh, Sing for me. Uh, All right, don't sing for me. <laughs> Dank and mouldy place. Where have you taken me? You're asking me, where have I taken you? Well, let me tell you. A place where no one will hear your cries for help and you will languish forgotten and unloved. Are we in Malaysia? No, no, no. The Department of Foreign Affairs. We're downstairs in the disabled toilet. What if a disabled person wants to use it? Not very likely, it's downstairs. And you know something? From an escape perspective, your range of alternatives is of a negative specificity. <laughs> God, I wish I'd given his anaesthetist more money. Planning, plotting, in the shadows lurking, waiting. Watching Abbott's poison working Ready for a fine opportunity to shine Even now I feel it coursing through my blood The miraculous revival of K-Rod It was I whom the population chose to lead I was rolled by a pack of faceless men So to hell with the moribund UN I will be Prime Minister again Kevin, I'd love to apologise and offer you a compensation package Can I trust you? I swear on the Bible But uh, you're a non-believer I think you'll find that doesn't affect my religious affiliations So... Oh, what the fuck is this fucking offer? Where would you like to be? Yes. Foreign Minister. Oh, I, I already was Foreign Minister. Just joking. 
I will have no part of this soap opera. Caven, sometimes I wish things could go back to the way they were before. I was so mistaken, I thought that I could be the working family's leader, though I am not a breeder. The media's relentless, they've got it in for me with biased propaganda that's just this side of slander. Tony Butch has at last undone me. I can't face him on my pet Malone. I'm a shy and awkward girl from Anley. I have come to formulate the view. Caven, the ALP needs you. My sentiments exactly. I knew you'd see the light. Ah, yes, they now want Kevin, their saviour from 07. Got no time for factions, neither left nor right. Their bowels will turn to water. I've got a new aorta. So stand aside and watch the polls track higher. I am Mr. Personality. Bow before the new improved messiah. Oh, wait a bit. I've got to think this through. And you shall be my number two. Now's the time for reconciliation. Past mistakes are ancient history. You and I will lead a new one nation. We're a team united in one front. Cop this, you ego driven. I'll make sure I do it properly this time. <laughs> Sayonara, Cho Cho Sen. <laughs> and don't even think about a state funeral. <laughs> <laughs> Never dies. <laughs> Rudd can't be broken. No one can beat me. Ask Wayne Swan. Numbers don't lie. Voters have spoken. None shall unseat me. Julia's gone. None can defeat me. Rod lives on.